If you've ever spent any length of time in the Fort York neighborhood, then there's going to be one building that's going to stand out. Think Art Deco, beautiful water fountain, and circular roundabout, and then an iconic red sign on top. In case you haven't guessed it, we're going to be featuring the Tip Top Lofts at 637 Lakeshore. So this is one of my favorite areas in Fort York, and we're going to talk a little bit about the features and benefits of the building, so keep on watching. Before we get started, I'm Stephanie Noss with the Homeplicity Realty Group. I've been selling real estate for 15 years, and I am passionate about helping our clients build and develop wealth through real estate. If you're interested in information on Toronto real estate, buying a home, selling a home, or investing in real estate, then I hope you'll consider subscribing to our channel. If you like this kind of content, go ahead and give it a like. And if there's anything else that you'd like to see, any other buildings that you'd like us to feature and highlight, then go ahead and comment in the link down below. Okay, so let's get into the tip top lofts. Why do people like it? What are the real estate values? How many suites are there? What was it originally? I think we can get a pretty good idea that it used to be one of the Toronto retailers that the tip top lofts, it was originally converted in 1929 and context development converted it in 2005 into 256 suites. The bottom half is actually hard loft conversions and then the upper levels are soft lofts and some two level lofts so there's a really nice mix and there's enough units that are sharing in the total cost of the maintenance to keep that pretty affordable it's a very well managed building and the amenities are fantastic there is a really nice state-of-the-art gym a media room a party room an outdoor space the building has a concierge which is really nice for a loft and it is pet friendly as is all of Fort York. If you actually would like some more information on Fort York and why I love the area and some of the highlights and features, go ahead and click this video on everything we love about Fort York and you can hear all about that. Now let's get back to the tip top lofts at 637 Lakeshore. Basically the suites are going to range from 400 square feet up to over 3,000 square feet for some of the really large ones. As mentioned it's a mix of hard lofts and soft lofts. They're beautiful. As of the time that we're filming this video, there are currently three for sale and two for lease. So if you'd like to take a look at those, then you can actually click the link in the description down below. The link is evergreen, but even if units sell or lease, any new ones that are coming in the market will be available to you. So even if you're watching this down the road, don't worry, you can still access and take a look at those on our website. Enjoy. There's some really beautiful suites in there. So the building's trending around $1,160 a square foot at the time of filming the video. Obviously this is something that's going to go up and down with the market, but that's where we're sitting at today, which is pretty much in line with a lot of the other buildings in the area. I think Fort York is about around 1050 at the moment because it is a loft. It is commanding a little bit of a premium. It's a great building. Fort York I love as well. I used to live in the area for nine years. This is one of my favorite buildings in all of downtown and for all of the Toronto lofts and it's very popular on our website so if you actually are interested in a custom list of properties in Fort York feel free to DM me or visit our website in the description link below and if you have a property in the tip top lofts that you're interested in selling and you'd like to know the value and just some of the things that you can do to make sure that it's maximized and ready for sale I welcome the opportunity to chat with you. If you are really interested in seeing beautiful listings and real estate information then we hope you'll consider following us on Instagram and Facebook at Homeplicity Realty. Feel free to like and share and subscribe and if you have any other questions or need anything comment down below. Until next time, bye!